Stephen, an incredibly dramatic game tonight. You, you've got a draw, but I guess it must feel like a win because you've preserved your own status in the Betway Premier League. Definitely, yeah. Um, I knew before the game I needed two legs. Um, obviously, it was going for the win, but uh, Kim's a really good friend as well. I felt really sorry for him out there. and um, Yeah, I'm just unfortunate for Kim. He's, he's going out now, but uh, he's done well in the Premier League and on, a, on his debut and hope he's there again next year. Yeah, I guess from your side, at 3-0 down, you had to, to claw your way back into the game and you managed to do that. At 3-0 down, I was thinking, um, come on, I need two legs. Yeah. <laughs> um, the start of the match, I was thinking, come on, just win it. But um, no, no, he put the pressure on straight from the off, mm. took the darts off me and um, yeah, it was always going to be difficult after that. I guess it was probably a new experience for you as well, knowing that you, you needed two legs to stay in and it wasn't necessarily about trying to win the game, but to get those two legs. How, have you ever been in that position before? Definitely not. I mean, this is uh, my first Premier League. Um, obviously, that was something new to me, and um, I was really, really nervous. Um, probably the most nervous I've been in the Premier League, knowing that you only need two legs to stay in for another um, six weeks. And it's, yeah. Uh, yeah, just, I'm so happy. Yeah, I mean, in a few weeks' time, that leg at the end there that's, that's got you a point, how important do you think that might, might come in six, seven weeks? Of course, yeah. I mean, obviously, the, the aim tonight was to stay in, but was not to lose as well. So um, that point could be massive heading into the uh, into the next rounds, and hopefully, it can push me into the uh, the top four. Mm, you get to refocus now. You, I think you've got a weekend now to to get your head together again, probably after this, and and then look at, at challenging for the playoffs. Definitely, yeah. I'm gonna put a lot of groundwork in. I'm gonna stay in the garage and just um, just get myself up to where I need to be, standard wise. Um, still don't feel like I'm 100%, but uh, yeah, ground that draw out tonight and uh, it, it's a good point and hopefully two points next week. You've played everybody in this tournament once so far. How do you feel the last nine weeks have been for you? <laughs> Dramatic, um, tiring, scary, um, all them words. Just really nervous most of the time. Getting used to the crowds, getting used to the venues. Um, getting used to, to being away from the family a lot, a lot as well, but uh, it's something I love doing. Um, it's the best tournament in the world for me, um, even better than the Wells. And uh, yeah, you get to show what you're all about over 16 weeks on uh, Sky TV, which is always a good thing. Yeah, the good thing for you is you, you've got the remaining weeks. You'll be better for this experience as well. Definitely, yeah. I mean, as I said, this is my debut. It was always going to be nervous and... Uh, I'm just glad to. Uh, I'll be glad to get this year out of the way. Hopefully, I can push into the uh, into the top four and into London. But uh, we'll just see how the next weeks progress, and uh, I'll just I'll be trying my best as always. And you get to spend Easter in your garage, eh? In my garage, or feeding the rabbits. I've just bought some rabbits, so I'll have to look after them as well. And you're after a uh, second-hand cage, I think. So one day. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, mate. No problem. Cheers. Bye.